Virginia Creeper Trail, and I have found Bear Girl! Hello! Didn't quit! Yeah! Yay. She's a trooper! Saw her last night, and we camped at the same place. Oh, the other side is cute. But yeah, so now we're hiking a little bit on the Virginia Creeper Trail, getting into Damascus. Town day! Town day! <laughs> Fall colors! Laurel Creek. Oh, so pretty. Hello! From the Laurel Creek. Pretty. Oh, look at the colors of the trees. I love it. So pretty. I stopped at this stream to get some water because I've got like five miles, five and a half miles up into town. And me being me, I slipped and one foot got very wet. And now it's very cold. So my break is going to be a little bit shorter than I was going to make it, but I really don't care because I'm about to be in town. And then I can take them off and put on dry socks and do laundry. Oh no, I'm not doing laundry here. But at least they will dry. Damascus Diner. Time to eat. Doing chores in Damascus. Resupply and outfitters and post office. Oh ah, yeah. <laughs> the new Appalachian Trail Conservancy building yeah, that's opening like or yeah I guess it just opened but they have the elevation profile of the trail so that's Katahdin that's all the whites and everything there's through like mid-Atlantic through Harpers Ferry Virginia and that's what we're about to hit <laughs> the Smokies and it's gonna be cold as heck very cool though So Damascus was a lot of fun. I was there with a group, a good group of people. Um, got there at like between one or two yesterday. So kind of had the whole day to chill. So that should be productive. And then we went out to dinner and had drinks. And then um, today took like all the time in the morning, went to the Damascus diner, which was delicious. I switched out, my tank top was finally sent home. Um, picked up a long sleeve shirt, um, so it's nice I can layer this with my fleece to stay a bit warmer, but then also when I'm warm, like during the day when I'm hiking, I can still have my arms kind of covered because the tank top is getting a little too chilly. I'm just doing a short 10 miles. It's like 10.2 miles to this first shelter because tomorrow I'm doing my personal challenge with myself. I wanted to do one 30 mile day on trail and tomorrow's the day and it's actually going to be 32.1 miles to get to boots off hostel and then i'm gonna zero there because i'm gonna need it after that <laughs> so i just resupplied to get me through today from the 30 mile day tomorrow oh i'm excited oh my gosh we were talking about it in damascus at dinner and it's finally here <laughs> Tennessee Virginia state line. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> wow. Done with Virginia. That is crazy. The longest state. It came and went. Man. Man. You know, everyone talks about the Virginia blues, mostly like nobos, how they get really sad. Um, through Virginia because it's like the same thing. It's so long. Um, 
I did not experience that. And we were talking about this at dinner too. Like none of us really experienced the Virginia blues. I could say I had it in a different sense in the sense that when I first started Virginia, I was having my hardest time mentally and I was struggling with that. Like the aloneness and just a total switch of like flipping south. But Virginia has been gorgeous and so many different landscapes and views and I've loved it. It's been beautiful. Wow. I'm in Tennessee. I'm almost home. Alrighty. Today's the day. It is 5 a.m. on the dot. I'm all parked up. Bag is ready. Let's roll. 30 mile day. Here we go. I am particularly grateful to be seeing some form of light right now because I've been in two hours of night hiking and not just night hiking but darkness hiking because my headlamp is not really functioning well slash at all so I've been using my uh, my phone <laughs> my phone camera like flashlight because I need to see where I'm going for a little bit I was just using the light of the moon up there when it was breaking through the trees and that was honestly doing better than my headlamp <laughs> but we're getting there the sun is coming yay there's a pink sky from the sunrise through the like yellow and green and orange leaves down in the valley with the colors. Ah, so pretty. Lovely morning. It's a great day for 30 miles. Gonna take a quick break on this nice bench. A day of quick breaks. Quick little breaks and slow and steady hiking. I'm just trying to average like a steady two and a half mile pace. Um, so if I find myself like speeding up, going faster, I'm just kind of like back off, slow down two and a half miles. So yeah, slow and steady. Pretty colors. Yay fall. Over there too. And up there. Stopped for a little break at Vanda Venter Shelter. And there are these rocks behind it. With an awesome view. I think it's Watuga Lake down there. Oh, so pretty and all the fall colors. And the mountains. Mm, I love it. I'm right at 22, uh, like between 22 and 23 miles, which is right around my biggest day ever. My biggest day ever is 23.2, which I did to get through Grayson Highlands um, a few days ago. And that's my biggest day so far, which I'm right about there now. And I need to do like 10 more miles. So that's kind of weird. but. I'm making good time and I need to keep moving and filter more water because I'm thirsty. Well, my foot caught a rock and then in the process of saving it from falling, caught another rock. So, uh, this is where I've landed. Oh, uh, kind of got my leg good on that one. Nice. <laughs> uh, I'm glad I didn't roll all the way down the hill. I think I'm getting tired. <laughs> uh, okay. Time to get up and keep going. Got like... Like eight more miles. Seven and a half more miles. Something like that. Yay. So, uh... I did get my leg 
on a branch pretty good. Oh my gosh, I can't focus this. No. Uh, I think, oh, that's what I got it on. That branch, because I went right. Okay. Well. Gonna rinse it off and keep going. Joy. Boots off. I've made it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Boots off hostel, staying in the bunkhouse. This is my, uh, where I retreated to after my 32 mile day. Very cute. Bunkhouse. Hey there. <laughs> got a really nice space here all the tables there's like the little cabins you can rent out down there and then they do fires every night which I did not um, go to enjoy last night because I just showered and went to bed but tonight I'll go enjoy the fire yeah I'm feeling surprisingly not too bad today definitely like sore and achy I'm gonna do some stretching later also, the day is beautiful. Today was the day it's supposed to be storming. And it's really nice. Which I'm happy for the rest of my friends that I met because they are all hiking today to get here. Also, goodbye to my fanny pack. The zipper broke here. And it's pretty worn down. Had some holes. And got a new one, which I'll show you in a moment. But for now, donating it to the hiker box. Maybe someone else will find good use from it. Bunkhouse at Boots Up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys, this is so dark. Oh, but I know. <laughs> oh, I know. Yeah. Are we? We're all the the colors of the rainbow. Wait, am I gonna be on YouTube? <laughs> yeah, you will. Yes. I mean, wait. Coral <laughs> <laughs> Fork. Crossing over it. And then I have friends. Some of my colleagues are coming to join me hiking. So they're not getting here until way later. So we're just camping right there by the road, but I'm excited to see them. So I'll get set up and chill and wait for them. Well, this is cool. The trail kind of wraps around these rocks here, right along Laurel Fort still. Ooh. I thought it was a lot cooler. And there is Laurel Fork Falls. That is an awesome waterfall. So I'm at a camp. I'm all set up. All tent is all up and everything. And I'm eating dinner and living the life right now because I am eating pot roast in a Ziploc bag that Jefferson from Boots Off Hostel so graciously gave me to pack out. It is delicious. It's still pretty warm actually. And then also there is um, a group of friends here kind of doing a little reunion um, at the little campsite over and they just gave me a beer. So I'm sitting here eating and drinking all set up in camp waiting for my friends to show up so yay turned out to be an awesome day shout out to jefferson for the fantastic pot roast view smile <laughs> i'll take a video of you taking a picture of me <laughs> the crew oh God, is here <laughs> Hello friends, they got in last night at like 
10 p.m. Hike with Slice. Hike, Hike with, with slice. slice. Hike with Slice. And Beer Girl. Yo. What's up? The whole squad. So pretty up here. Ow, I just got hit in the face by a leaf. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Congrats, you've all made it 15 miles. 15 miles. That's a big day. Mountaineer Falls. Just a little sprinkle. That'd be really fun to fall down. Ooh, that'd be exciting. How are we doing today, everyone? Excellent. Happy to be Good alive. at this moment. Yeah. Very good. Yay. What? Super. Super. <laughs> Side trail to Jones Falls. Really pretty. And Alex and Tabitha. <laughs> Pretty. And the fall colors! Yay! <laughs> Everyone say hi! Hi! <laughs> That's so pretty. Bye bye! Happy Yay! See you guys! Woo! So happy when friends have joined me. We just stuffed our faces with Mexican food and I have made it to Mountain Harbor BB. Staying here tonight. Ended up getting a bunk. It's super cute. I'm gonna get the like number one rated breakfast on trail. I'm excited for that.